Well, maybe you've seen one, an email scheme promoting medicine for diabetes and other common medical conditions. Well, John Paschal, president and CEO of the Better Business Bureau here in Southeast Texas, is with us to talk about that very topic. John, thanks for being here. Absolutely. Okay, miracle cure, ladies and gentlemen. We've heard that for almost so many decades now. Is there such a thing, and why are people being taken in by this? Well, there certainly can be miracle cures, but what often happens, Greg, people are taken in by this scheme. They get an email or something, uh, maybe something on a website that indicates a miracle cure, in this case for diabetes. Well, that would be huge if that were true. Mm -hmm. But they get taken in, they get this email, and then they link them to a website where they can purchase this miracle drug that just happens to be on sale for the next 20 minutes or whatever the case right. is. So people do order it and what they find out is that it may be some type of vitamin supplement but it's not really a cure for diabetes and, and people can be taken in by that scheme. You know it's not only diabetes I would, I'm thinking here. You've got other medical maladies that uh, they also try to pick on to try to get the emotional side of people, right? Exactly right. And what they want people to do is to order online, order the product, which which may help them feel better, but it may not be that cure. Mm -hmm. The other danger is, though, that when they order online, they're ordering from somebody they don't know. So you just put your credit card information out and personal information out that could lead to identity theft or other schemes later on. Okay, so bottom line, how do you spot a quack cure? It is, there are some flags you can look for. One, they do claim it's a miracle cure, but there's a conspiracy to keep it secret. You won't know about it. Uh, something that uh, the government's trying to keep you from finding out. That's why you must find it only from us. Mm -hmm. Well, we know that if there was a miracle cure for diabetes, it would be all over the news. It would be well reported, not, yeah. not just on their website. One product does it all. It cures diabetes, it cures the common cold, and it fixes your hangnail and toe fungus. I, oh, I mean, crazy things that, <laughs> yeah. that they claim. Personal testimonials, they may use um, uh, large organizations, NASA, Harvard, John Hopkins, but hmm. personal testimonials from celebrities, but not scientific evidence or studies to back up what's actually in it or uh, effects of this miracle cure, if you yeah. will. It's all natural. Something could be all natural, but it may not be safe. It may not even be legal, but it could be all natural. That doesn't necessarily mean it's, it's good or a miracle cure. Certainly, consumers want to be cautious. Check with their doctor before they take any drug that they think may be a miracle cure. That's, it's been used for years, but it does t t still take people in. All right, John, if you have any questions, be sure and contact the BBB, correct? BBB.org, 835-5348. All right, John, thanks so much. Great insight once again. Thanks for being with us.